the new DJI Neo literally a pocket sized drone that has got no business being out in these sort of windy conditions I don't know if you can actually hear me quite well I am using the microphone on the camera what I'm thinking I'm gonna have to do is just switch over to my windshielded mic just so you can hear me properly but what I'm going to be doing on this video is literally a strong wind test with this DJI Neo just to see what its limits are and how it performs if you do get caught out in a bit of a gust of wind so let's get into it So I came out onto the banks of the Humber to perform a stock footage test with this DJI Neo and a couple of other DJI drones such as the Mini 2, the Mini 3 Pro and the Mini 4. However, it is just way too windy uh, to be able to perform that test. Um, I'm absolutely getting blown like hell. So what I've decided to do is waste not, want not if it's too uh, tough to get some stock footage and some smooth footage from these drones. Let's just see how this performs in the wind but as you can see we've got absolutely no cover whatsoever now the max speed that DJI advertised that this drone can do is of course 8 meters per second in sport mode and it has got level 4 wind resistance now looking at the forecast at the ground we're showing 8 meters per second and gusts up to 14 okay and that's at the ground at 30 meters 9 meters per second 60 meters 9 meters per second so we are really up at the limits so let's just cut to the DJI fly app and as you can see we are all connected uh, so let's go ahead and hit that auto takeoff and just see what happens we're taking off in Take normal off. mode okay ah! straight away the drone is being blown completely out the way okay that was not a good start that was not a good start it completely got blew away from me let's try and make it back there we go oh bloody hell no idea how it just did that <laughs> oh my god, he just nearly flipped up and we nearly lost it. Incredible, incredible. Oh my god, we just nearly lost it. Let's come a bit closer. Okay, and let's just head out slightly. Oh my goodness, this is absolutely incredible. As you can see, we are really getting battered here and we'll flick to our main camera. As you can see there, it is heavily uh, heading into the wind. But where I think this drone has got a bit of a limitation, okay, I think if we put it on its side, it really does struggle even further. So let's just put it to its side and see what happens. Oh, there we go, look. Oh, it's really struggling. It is really struggling. Okay, as you can see, it's dancing around in the wind quite a fair bit. Oh, and it's off. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Right, let's spin it back towards us. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Incredible. What on earth is going on? It just nearly flipped up again. <laughs> nice. Guys, do not put your poor drone through this. Okay, it is incredible. Um, I'm not sure if the camera caught that, but for some reason, it decided to nearly flip. Look at it, really, really struggling. Let's just bring it down ever so slightly. Okay. Wow. This is absolutely unreal. Yeah, we're really struggling now, guys. We're actually getting blown backwards. Hopefully the camera is picking that up. Yeah, we're getting blown backwards. As you can see on the DJI Fly app, it's struggling to hold its position. So let's do something a bit crazy. Let's see if it can perform any sort of, sort of video. Let's just try fly along in sport mode. Really struggling to make headway. Battery is obviously heavily getting depleted here. Like I say, we're really getting battered. Not good at all. Let's see if I switch to quick shot mode, if I can perform a basic droney. We'll leave the distance, I don't know, six meters. Let's Three. click start and just see what Three. happens. One, two. It's poor drone. One. Should not be out here. DJ, I do say you should just basically um, have light wind, but absolutely incredible. There you go, maybe we've got a little bit of stock footage there. 
okay um wow and the drone is just returning back to where it should be but as you can see it's really getting blown around really getting blown around we are in sport mode so we've got max power available okay uh, i think what's best is to dry try just bring the drone back to us oh man uh, it's struggling so much wow full speed we're doing 1.5 meters let's just see what happens if i try fly into the wind full sport mode two and a half meters per second strong gusts there so guys what this drone is actually doing is pretty incredible oh my god it just nearly flipped again wow wow this is look crazy let's just let's just head backwards let's hope we can make it back <laughs> absolutely incredible let's try and pull forward again my god it keeps wanting to flip let's try come forward Oh my god, such slow progress. Oh man, look at this, look at that bank angle. <laughs> Incredible. And if I let go of the sticks, it's absolutely dancing around like hell. Wow. Well, like I said, guys, with battery, we've got 51%. If I put it sideways onto the wind, it does seem to struggle a little bit. Look, it's off. So side wind performance is pretty poor. And then what for some reason it does is clears off, look. Look, it just rises up. There we go, look. It just rises up and flies off. Not good at all. Wow. But it's handling it. It's absolutely handling it absolutely incredible so let's just go for a little flight up and down uh, while well, we've still got some battery left and just see how well it does maybe try one more quick shot just to see if we can get some stock footage three there we go let's two, see if we can one really struggling really struggling we're not even going to attempt to rock it oh man it's getting blown all over Shall we quickly try an active tracking mode? See if, see how well it does. I mean, it's following me. Oh, it's struggling. Oh, it's going off on one. Oh my goodness. Guys, this thing's actually quite incredible. Okay, we've got 27% uh, battery left. Let's not take any more chances. Let's land the drone. Man. So it's fair to say I would absolutely not recommend putting your DJI Neo in basically a situation like this. It is probably just about on the limit to what you'd put a Mini 4 Pro, let alone something like this. But as you saw, the capabilities on this piece of kit are absolutely incredible. There was a couple of really hairy moments, I don't think I caught them on camera, where essentially what the drone did is I think it got caught by the wind and it kept flipping up and then somehow righting itself. Really, really scary. I thought it was going to end up in the Humber. I mean, look, look, look at the props going. 
that's how windy it is out here okay so ultimately you know more tests will come with this little piece of kit uh, this was definitely successful and if you do want to grab one I will leave a link in the video description so you can go grab one either from Amazon or DJI Direct don't really like doing these sort of things but of course my videos are unsponsored okay I don't get paid for doing these so of course if you are thinking of buying one clicking on an affiliate link really does help the channel out and of course you know I did make sure that I had a policy from my preferred drone insurance company cover drone before coming out of here especially knowing what I was going to be doing so if you want to get a quote on your new DJI Neo or indeed any other drone that you might have in your arsenal then please do check out cover drone and you can again get a quote using the link in the video description so if you found this video useful please do give it a big thumbs up it tells the YouTube algorithm more people just like you might want to watch my content subscribe if you're awesome and until next time see you again soon